Moorhead's fire department is dealing with a COVID-19 outbreak at one of its stations. And while officials couldn't give us an exact number, several sources tell Valley News Live about 60% of employees have been infected. Valley News team's crime and safety reporter Bailey Hurley talked with the fire chief today who says the outbreak might impact response times. Moorhead Fire Chief Rich Dyson says it's been about a week since many of his employees at the North Moorhead station started becoming infected with COVID-19. We did some contact tracing and it just seemed like the more people would go in and get tested, unbeknownst to them, they'd test positives. Dyson says they started separating shifts and teams at the start of COVID-19 to help slow the spread and protect employees on top of following all other CDC guidelines. It's kind of a punch in the gut for us, really, where you feel bad, you think you're doing everything right. And the one thing I can say is that, you know, when you think when you think you're caught up to it, you're not. Dyson says what healthy workers they have left have now been placed at their other Moorhead station, saying for the meantime, they'll have limited response out of this building, but assures North Moorhead residents they're still in good hands if things go wrong, saying impacts to response times will be minimal. So if it's a medical call or whatever, we'll have one or two people here for the next few days. And then um, we are still responding out of our station on 20th Avenue. And then we have mutual aid with both Northside stations in, in Fargo where they can come over and still meet our response times. Dyson says Moorhead Fire also has mutual aid agreements with West Fargo, Dilworth and Horace and says they'll assist in future calls until the Moorhead station is healthy again. In Moorhead, Bailey Hurley, Valley News Live. Dyson adds that all those infected with the virus are recuperating at home and says so far none of his employees have had to be hospitalized. Minnesota